you know, what, what is going to be our greatest condemnation? When we look at Jesus Christ, the example of Jesus, Jesus came, and what did Jesus give? How much Jesus left out there? Hmm? Sometimes I watch just portrayals, cinema trying to enact, and I can't even look. Sometimes when they drive in the nail on any hand, me have to turn my eye, big man like me. You hear me? And no portrayal can show you. His skin was peeled from his body. He was beaten and bloody and bruised beyond recognition. He was spit on the king of glory, the lord of all. His face was disfigured. He was weary and bleeding. His back was torn and whipped and everything. And he, the carpenter, who knew what it was every day to have nails put in wood, he himself was nailed to a cross, the sinless lamb for you and for me. He gave his all. And he deserves our all. Stop giving God leftovers. Stop giving God what half a heart. Half-heartedly coming to church. Half-heartedly going in your Bible. Half-heartedly praying. Every discipline, you do it half. And some people still believe they're doing God a favor with the little they're giving him. But when you look at the King of glory, God Almighty, his sacrifice was all. Poured out like an offering for me and for you. How can we look at that and still give him leftovers and half hearts?